It's called a bouncing bubble. <laughs> How do you make a bubble bounce on your hand? Well, the secret, believe it or not, is that glove. See, when that bubble touches your skin, there's oil and dirt on your skin, it automatically pops. But I'm just using some dish soap here, and I made this little bubble wand. When it touches the glove here, it, there's no oil or dirt that's there, and you can actually make a bouncing bubble. No glycerin, nothing's fancy, just, that's right, dish soap in water. But wouldn't it be fun if you could put something in the bubble? Now, I've done it before using dry ice, but let's say you don't have dry ice. Look at this contraption. I simply used a humidifier, that's right, I can't use anything for what it's intended for, and the tube comes around from the hardware store, and that's your humidity, right? That's your vapor, the water vapor that's coming out. So now watch what happens. You dip this in like this, and now you can fill the bubble with the water vapor. Now look, you've got a bouncing, what we call a boo bubble. When you touch it, it pops. How cool is that? I know, hours of fun for the kids. You don't need dry ice for this original one that's here. It'll stay even on the towel for just a second. Ah, but now you can create your own bouncing bubble with a little bit of uh, water vapor that's inside and it's easy to do. I'm Steve Spangler and that's your Bubble Bursting Science Minute.